Shalom, my king. We'll give all praises and glory to Yahweh. By Shem, Yahweh Shai, by Shem, Rakakwadash. Double honors to the elders and apostles of GMS who rule and teach well. And citation to all the occupants, all four corners of the earth who's pushing the truth with sincerity. Shalom, my king. Shalom, yeah, and the truth is coming out of the Bible, the Holy Bible, the scriptures which was given to the Israelites, which is our. Um, Letters written from Israelites to Israelites by Israelites, <laughs> not to the other nations, not to the heathens, but it was sent to the Esau. The Lord put a spirit in Esau to make this turn this book and compile it and push it all over the world. Because why our people are all over the world, that's why the Bible is the number one soul book on the earth, man. God. The best seller. Mm -hmm. And guess what? It always been and always will be, man. Because why we are as the sand of the sea, so we're everywhere, God. we're everywhere, right. And we're here in Babylon the Great. We watching what the division, Kinda. the separation, the continual downfall of this place. Look at the morals of these people, man. The, the, the mental mind state of these people. Even the, the Republicans, you don't know the difference between the Republican and the Democrat right nah, now, man. Nah. <clears throat> and, and, and that's a split between this here. And, and that's a simple split. And look what you see, the red and the blue. You, you simpletons don't understand how simple the, the, uh, this devil's plan is. It's a red and blue thing. Because a lot of you, you got uh, the Republicans and Democrats. It starts from, from your political system. You go on to your gangs. You got the Crips and the Bloods. You bang red and blue. I just watched a movie, a documentary the other day. Come to find out, in California, it's a car, uh, do the red and blue thing too. You know what I'm saying? This devil has been dealing with these color systems and stuff for some quite some time. But guess what? Now this is exposing time. We're lifting up that skirt this devil has on, man. That's right, yeah. yeah. Let's get that verse from each other. Because um, the Lord is, once you see a division amongst the nation, that's a sign that, that these people are going down. Because if you go back in, um, back in what, the, let's say the 1600s, 1700s, 1500s, every war that you've seen was set up by the elites, man. Huh. Uh, the north and the south really didn't give two fucks what was going on, man. You think Esau cared about some slaves down south? Hell no. Just what you said, the elites, they go all the way, it, it trickled from the Civil War all the way down to what's now the gangs and everything that's in the world, man. Everything is is, is, is controlled by these elites. It's expo it, we expose them right now in these in these later times right now. And through the and through the um, the um, science of divide and conquer, you as the person up top could sneak in and steal and take everything. You could sneak in while they right. fight each other. You could sneak mm -hmm. in and in um, what's the word when the ginger ties the neighborhood. Gentrify. Uh, gentrify the neighborhood. You done set up the gangs to fight each other. Esau done came in and bought all the houses, done bought all the buildings. Now he owned the whole block. Because okay. the cost of this living, first off, it was nothing but one big group of people here. Mm -hmm. Let's make them fight each other, make the cost of living go down. We're going to come to and buy it up and take raise that over. price up. We're going to take it over. Mm -hmm. Divide and conquer. Through the divide and conquer, we done stole their neighborhood. Hey, look, what, what my got in his hand? He, put, he got a couple Starbucks right there. Just what you going to. They'll kick Jake out and put a bunch of Starbucks in mm -hmm. and Whole Foods. We used to call it back in the day Whole Checks. Because you go in there, you spend about 20 bucks, man. You only came up with two things, man. Yeah. You in that uh, bag of, of rice or whatever. It's, <laughs> no shit, man. You know what I'm saying? And now this is causing the problem because there's more Edomites coming to a state of poverty. Mm -hmm. They starting to feel that affliction that, that's been on us for a long time. So they, they hate it, man. Mm -hmm. Let's get the first. Huh. Which one we start for? Just say yeah, whatever you want. Uh, Let's do, we start with the house of Okay, um, Isaiah 19, 15, 2. This is Isaiah 19 and 2. And I will set the Egyptians against the Egyptians. And they shall fight everyone against his brother. Yeah, you're going to see your big fight break out very soon between these Egyptians and these Egyptians. Because it's Edomite on Edomite, Jake on Jake. Um, it's um American on American. That's another key word for Egyptian on Egyptian. Well, we'll, we'll, we'll expect down what they're gonna be fighting over because right now you got people at these jobs that are gonna um be rebelling against this um Vanessa. The the un the un Vanessas against versus the, the Vanessas. Vanessas. You got people who want to who want to wear masks all day long against people who don't want to wear masks. The unmasked versus the mask. Because when you go outside, you got goofies that want to wear masks outside. And guess what? We don't want to wear masks outside. That's we, right. There's an eating my woman right now who got a video from um Vedesta, Illinois, that's going viral, 
And it's letting you know the sicknesses that you're getting from these damn masks that you wear, yeah. man. And how it's jacking up the kids. That shit like putting a filter on your exhaust system. You done fucking covered up your exhaust system. You a fucking idiot. Hey, uh, your hey. muffler. You done covered your, covered up your muffler. And what does that do to your body? It gives you high blood pressure. It gives you bumps on your face. You know what I'm saying? Because hell, I got bumps coming upon my face from shit. From wearing a mask all the time. I gotta wear it in public. You get um bad breath. It rots your teeth yeah, out. You yeah, get all yeah. sorts of shit, man. You gotta burp in your mask and everything. When you burping, you supposed to let that shit out, man. These people are nasty, man. But Esau don't know what he's doing. He set it up to fuck the people up. It's called population depopulation. Depopulation control, man. Yep. Um, it's called the Georgia Guys Zone. It's called the um, Megiddo Plant. Mm -hmm. It's called the um, we go on and on. You know what I'm saying? He has the Megiddo is more on um, when they come straight for Jake. That's that straight all hell on Jacob's trouble, boy. You fucked up. You niggas Kinda. gonna get it. They gonna okay, get it. Okay, it's like So we're gonna just deal with the population control. Hell yeah. They so so get we got you we got the uh, Georgia Guy Stone, which will let you know. Yeah. You know. Get, get this number down to a certain number. <laughs> Kind. Yeah. He says, um, let me start by this uh, Isaiah nineteen and two, and I and I will set, I will set the Egyptians against the Egyptians. What's another thing the Egyptians are gonna be fighting over, man? Lack of bread, man. Right now, you already got a shortage shortages on your shelves where your shelves are not fully completed, f fully loaded up with, with material. Um, you, you go into one area, it's big gaps. It's probably not too much bread left, a, little, a few different. Um, what you could have chose from 30 different pops, now it's probably only seven selections. So what you dealing with? You dealing with um, people not delivering things, containers stuck on um, the fucking beaches mm -hmm. of California. Your largest... Doctor centers in North America are, um, they can't even lo load the ships up right now, man. It's all backed up, man. It's, it's hundreds, it's, it's hundreds of ships out there, man. Just waiting to be docked. So what, like the brother was saying, man, you, um, where we camp at, we go to CVS, man, to get a, a variety of drinks, man. It, that, 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 that was about a month ago. It ain't like that no more, man. The, the little snacks used to be able to get, they, it, you can get a bag of chips from uh, local chips. Other than that, they ain't got any different type of chips in there no more. Mm -hmm. that, that's letting you know, man. Different um, fast food chains running out of burger meat. Mm, they right. running out chicken. of burger meat. They running, they out, running out of chicken. Out of chicken. They you running out right. of ground beef. Mm -hmm. They running out of all type of products. Due to what? Esau not letting shit in this motherfucker, man. Because mm -hmm. this is designed by the elites. This ain't just like when they had that big ass boat just having to turn sideways. How the fuck this boat just happened to turn sideways in the middle of the uh, Sioux Canal over there? Um, oh, yeah. Yeah. That, yeah. All, everything is designed. Why are all these boats backed up in um in, in, in yeah. Long Beach? It's designed, man. Why did the um, farmers have to burn all their fruit and um, food and stuff? It's designed. Everything's designed, man. You know? We are seeing we are seeing the end right now, man. And they got the, they, they're, they're manufacturing the enemy. They've always been doing this, man. Yeah. Your enemy's been manufactured by by your, by, 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 by this great deceiver, man. And his damn television, man. Joe Biden just said what the brother said the other day. Yeah, we're going to have to figure out a way to protect you vaccinated from the unvaccinated. Mm. That's what he just said yesterday on the video, man. I was like, okay. Well, Australia already, got up. Um, he already helping that. Um, He already setting up in these people's mind. You got to be careful for these people. Oh, yeah. No, we need to be careful for y'all. Y'all the ones who've been the most motherfuckers dropping dead and sick. Come on, man. Well, Australia already got on um, concentration camps coming up. Man. Mm -hmm. They got concentration camps coming up where they're getting ready to separate everybody, man. From from the vaccination from the, to the non-vaccinated, you know? Times are coming into, man. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, these European countries ain't looking so beautiful no more, are no. they? Are they, people? Yeah, go ahead, visit them if you want. Yeah. <laughs> go ahead, nice bird. Oh, uh, this is Isaiah uh, 19 and 3. And the spirit of Egypt shall, 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 shall fell in the midst thereof. And I will destroy the council thereof. Yeah, is this the same Egypt you knew, what, 20 years ago? This is not the same Egypt. 20 years ago, you was looking to be a doctor, a lawyer, a physician, a, a, a nutrition. You was looking to be into sports. A lawyer, a doctor. You was, exactly. You wanted to be great in some. You wanted to be a pilot. You wanted to be an athlete. A nurse. Um, because man, anything. Slack real quick. The certificate. <laughs> Come on, man. You athletes. A lot of y'all want to be athletes. Guess what's going on in the sports ship? A lot of that shit's being sued. They're about to be uh fucking bankrupt very soon. You know what I'm saying? This this is all this is all program, man. Everything is programmed to be set up and to come down, man. All those the power of the Lord. The power of the Lord. 
all those um new all those owners they knew that this shit was gonna come they knew that it was coming soon man let's get that ecclesiastes free right quick huh. hell yeah there's a time <laughs> for everything the brothers and sisters they knew this was gonna come down why you think man a lot of them been selling their stocks a lot of these so-called rich people man hey man let me sell this shit before i lose everything man that's what a smart man would do most of these people coming in and spending money, they call them the, the new investors, the young ones, these young dummies, man, who done came up with some money. I'm thinking they're doing something, still believing in America. But most of your older, rich, white motherfuckers, man, they they, they relocate with their money, man. Right. Well, 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 let's be honest. See, we'll, we, how long we've been on here? We, we've been talking about this. So they've been left. Chicago been left for all those billionaires. How, uh, LA been left for a lot of billionaires. New York been left for a lot of billionaires. Where they going? A lot of them uh, plan on fleeing to the moon, but we know that ain't gonna happen. Where they fleeing to? Uh, different little spots like uh, Ice, Iceland, uh, New exactly. Zealand, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? These different spots where they trying to get away where the population is low. Yeah. Man, come on, man. You already know, mm -hmm. man. Um, I'm sorry, top of Ecclesiastes 3 and 1. To everything there is a season and time to every purpose under the heaven. What time is it for America? Downfall time for Babylon the Great. Yeah, this place, no, hey, ain't gonna be no more um, greatness for this place. It ain't gonna be no more crowds filled up in a stadium. Malls done. Go, yeah, mall. Oh, oh my goodness. Malls I, are done. I thought that been done. That's why we been stopped talking about that motherfucker. Who Look. the fuck go out to the mall, man? Especially with this COVID-19 shit. Man, come on. We went to a mall a couple weeks ago. Then we met. That shit was a ghost town. All they had was that spot we went to the other day. A little COVID setup. Yeah. <laughs> then that motherfucker selling $150 backpacks, man. A $20 backpack oh, yeah. for $150. <laughs> That's how you know they done, man. Come on, man. They, they sale. That was yeah, on sale. That was on sale. I told man, sell it to your mama. <laughs> and it's a wrap for this place, man. These malls are number um they exist they exist the days of yesterday for this place. Right? History. You know what I'm saying? History. It's like them little burger joints when bitches come out and they roller skates in the little history. mini skirt. That, history. Mm -hmm. Um the happy days. Fonzie got the leather coat on, man. History. Go they could jump a black boy down the street and hang him. History, man. Mm -hmm. You and you and you ain't prepared for that new age shit. Which is what suffering. <laughs> yeah. God. And um it's suffering. And guess what? Two thirds of our own people are enduring that suffering, man, because they ain't gonna hit clear to these words we speaking, man. You know what I'm saying? Even though the tribe is coming together right now, you know, two thirds gotta go, man. Very, very, very well. Cause y'all, let me start from the top. Cause y'all believe, y'all don't believe in these words it says, man. Oh, they, they, they help them keep the system. Exactly, up. exactly. They get mad at what we speak about. When they go to church, they wanna hear them smooth things, man. Please, that's three and one. To everything, there is a season. Ain't time to every purpose under heaven, and y'all don't, y'all don't, y'all don't understand it, man. He says, um, a, a time to be born, and a time to die, a time to plant, and a time to pluck up that which is planted, a time to kill, and a time to heal. America is not gonna be healed. How? Why would the Lord heal America? And um, it tells you, um, uh, um, take bomb for her. If she could be healed, it would be so. But she's not gonna be healed. She's not gonna be healed. She's not gonna be recovering. What the great recovery of America? Ain't gonna be recovering of America. Ain't gonna be greatness for America. Yeah, these people are. You got the drug addict, man. The opioid epi epidemic. Um, the so-called even with the marijuana. The marijuana that took hold of America, man. These people, they they depend on um substance just to make it through their day, man. So wait till there's a lack of substance, a lack of bread. All this shit fucks with your psychology, man. Mm -hmm. These people about to go crazy on each other. Mm -hmm. They man, looking for heroin. Look at your, your, your actor. Nigga died of cocaine overdose and heroin. Mm -hmm. And you're supposed to be a rich Hollywood actor making movies, man. Like, that life don't mean nothing. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. Go ahead, brother. It's like, bro. Oh, you what do you say? A hungry man is an angry man? Yeah, yeah. Going back to what yeah, you yeah, just said, man. Ooh. Everything about to be cut off, man. Your, your comfortability is about to be cut off, man. No more comfort upon this place, man. It was a time for everything. Yeah, it was a time for, for, for gatherings. Uh, it was a time y'all, uh, America was living great, man. Mm -hmm. We speak about this. Every, he was just going down the happy days air. You had happy homeless motherfuckers. Kind. They was at, uh, recently they was able to get their drugs around here. Yeah. Remember they was able to, so drug heads was happy around exactly. here. To everything, man. You had a, a bunch of Crocker used to just move to California with no money and just go live oh, on yeah. the streets. Oh, yeah, yeah, And then make it. Yeah, kind mm -hmm. Look, you, have... you got dudes who used to brag about just moving out from nowhere. You do 
Boy, move somewhere with nothing right now. Your ass might get blocked up and killed. Come on, man. These motherfuckers on the streets might get you. They had a spot in California called Death Row, man. But it was easy, easy living for the bums. They loved point. it. And remember, Skid Row. Slot. There you go. Skid Row. Remember it was. It, it was Skid Row. Come on, man. And that was like in the fifties. <laughs> It, you know what I'm saying? You was down out on drugs, whatever. Oh, yeah. You come there, <laughs> you get cleaned up. You, the American dream was moving on. Remember what I tell you? Yeah. Uh, in America, my whole thing was, hey, I thought you was coming here to get an apartment and you get a house. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Skid Row said, man, you just be D drugs, whatever. You get cleaned up, you get out of here. Hey, they bought you more drugs. Yeah, they kept more you drugs. Yeah, yeah. They said that it, it used to be a block. Come on, it man. It used to be like a little oh, yeah. area. Oh, yeah. Now it's a whole they fucking They got a movie neighborhood. about it. They got yeah. a movie about it's it, bro. It's a whole neighborhood. Yeah, they got a movie. You used to see it. Your boy, German soldier, I think he went, the German dude, he went over there and did a video. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, like, yeah, this shit's a whole village now. Skid Row done became a village. He talking about how the decline of Venice Beach, the Venice Beach German. That's what he's speaking about, man. I went on his page. They cleaned the beach up. Then I went back about a week ago, man. Motherfuckers moving Move right, right back, in. back in. Stop playing. <laughs> oh, yeah, they moving. <laughs> I mean, they said the, the homeless are moving back in. <laughs> After they, they, they said a truck. They didn't really move in with a truck, G. No, because he, he was one of the million people that was complaining about that shit. He's yeah. like, hold on, man. When I can't move here, it's one of the main reasons I, I left Austria because this shit was beautiful I, out yeah, here. Man, what is this? We had competitions out here. Everything was beautiful. It was a time for everything, man. Yeah. It was a time for everything, man. Oh, it was a time for being beautiful. Some of that. Hell yeah. It was time for when y'all could hang out and, and do what y'all want to do and, and be beautiful. And he, he sore, he sore eyed about that shit, man. That was his main purpose of moving out here, man. I got was, one for you. Kind of. A time to kill and a time to heal, a time to break down and a time to build up. A time to weep and a time to laugh. A time to mourn and a time to dance. Cause um, like the brother was saying, that time building up Venice Beach, Mm-hmm. Been on America. That was in the past, man. Right mm-hmm. now, they ain't gonna invest no more money in these different places. And he, he was, he was upset about that. And he was saying he, one of the main reasons he came out here, he got his little monkey job. He would go out there at Venice Beach and do his little workouts. And now he sees bums and areas he do his workout. He can't even do his workout no more because his gangs, his shoot ups, and all sorts of just, just wreaking havoc in his areas, man. Mm-hmm. They had kicked everybody out of there. Next, you know, a month and a half later, man, they coming back. They got these um, they got these um racquetball courts, right? Yeah, where, where you the bums, know, man, could just look, shot. man, come on, cause cause it, it, it's uh covered up yeah. in the element for the yeah. most part. Word. In California, even though you know the monkeys came out the song, it don't rain in California. It's true. In some parts, it don't yeah. rain for for certain times. It doesn't rain in Southern California. Cal- come on, man, it don't rain for a certain time, man. April might be your only rainy month in California. It rain on your ass. It rain and rain on your ass. But for the most part, it ain't never sun and and you yeah. you 70, 80 degree weather. So bums go out there and leave on the beach easily, bro. Yeah. So 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 some of these areas they was able to get. You know what I'm saying? Like brother was saying, they're gonna clean them up and not even move right back in, man. Look. Oh, the CTA train right over here, where we said, man. The bums and took over. One of the CTA ladies, like, hey, she just told the police, like, hey, man, what the hell, man? Can What can we do about this shit, man? Hey, my man, like, hey, man. Unless we get orders. Yeah, basically nothing. nothing. Basically nothing, man. Nothing. Nothing. The Lord. Man, it's a play. Man, listen, man. A play. It was time for everything. It was a sweet time when y'all didn't have to come through here and do it. Deal with them now. Now it is the time y'all got to deal with these people, man. That's right. Verse 6, a time to get and a, and a time to lose. A time to keep it, a time to cast away. And a lot of you, um, since you're speaking of homeless, man, you homeless, end up homeless and you're trying to keep everything you got with you, man. You're trying to hold on. Some of you might be having your bed with you on the cart. Who's just the homeless? Yeah, be having oh, shit. TV oh, come on, on top man. of that motherfucker. What is that? That nigga's crazy, man. Okay, man, the song, Bad Leg. Hey, she said, you can't carry everything you got, man. You're going to hurt your back. They got about three or four bags of uh, the old stuff in the house. <laughs> Yeah. It's gonna get worse because you gotta realize a lot of them was the ones just recently that lost their cribs. They ain't really realized, hey man, it ain't reality ain't kicked in. Like, hey man, you just need to skin on your back and a few draws to change it to and pants to change it to and keep moving. They they trying to keep everything, their memories. Look, we knew the world's cleanest bum. Man, uh, that dude was smooth as hell, man. The dude wore a shoot every day. Two of them. Man. You heard the other old school one with the hat? You got a few suits. You got a few suits. Like you said, the world's tennis bump. Yeah. My man's still in his world. Ain't believed it. Um, as long as he clean me. Look, you would have never knew he was homeless until he opened his mouth and told you. That motherfucker homeless for two, three years talking to us every night, man. We, we worked at the job. We didn't know he was homeless. My man. He said, yeah, where you about to go? They going to the crib? Yeah, man. What? I'm, oh, I'm, you talking about guns? I thought yeah. you talking about this other case. Oh, he said, yeah, I live right across the street. We said, where, man? It's a hotel across the street. Oh man, down there, down where? <laughs> oh yeah, man, by that trash. What, nigga? 
We didn't know the dude was homeless at all for damn near two, three years, man. So the nigga let us know oh he lived in the street underneath that hotel by the garbage. But the man had a motherfucking clean suit on with a tie. He may come in the bar, we let him in, think he's CEO and shit, man. <laughs> It's time to clean up drinks. One man got two or three drinks in his hand. Oh, that's how we kind of knew something was weird because when we start cleaning up the bar, that nigga grabbing everybody's drink that they didn't finish. And he drinking them up. He's like, oh, man, that, this dude weird as hell, man. Hey, hey, bro, you all right? We thought he was just drunk. But this shit crazy. He told you out there over there. That's the whole thing. Like, nah, I say that. Nah. Down there. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get these other verses, man. Let's go back to... Uh, Give me that mark, man. We're going to go through these verses right quick. Oh, my God. Jake be dope, man. It, hey. They, man, they be in their own world, man. Uh, give me one second. Like, bro. With the mark on. Yep. The one I had came up with. It's like uh, Mark 3 and two, uh, 25. Mm-hmm. This, um, this is, uh, I'm going to start at Mark, all uh, right. 3 and, 20, 3 and 24. And if a kingdom be divided against itself, the kingdom cannot stand. And if a house be divided against itself, the house cannot stand. Yeah, the Lord is making the world's greatest country on earth to be against itself, to be divided mm-hmm. on all levels, man. On all levels, man. It's going to be a, a gigantic race war where even people going to be fighting their own damn selves, man. They own people in their household. The Lord said it's going to even be in your household. Division from the country, from the whole state side, to the whole country, to your household. Look, they you gotta escape this. They got um different shows coming out lately. All your shows on TV are now about things that came ready to come up. Whether it be blackout, whether it be uh, people going against each other. Shit, let's be honest, that's that's been the anthem for at least fifteen to twenty years now. Hard. But I'm talking about now. It's in mainstream TV shows like yeah. um, this show called Nine One on Fox is coming out showing that shit. No, I agree. They, they movies, movies, and everything been about that, even but not TV, just man, even TV been showing you a faggot doomsday spirit. Yeah. Look at that. Um, uh, what's that? Walking Dead. That shit been on for a long time, man. That whole spirit. Um, Breaking Bad, man. That show you the end of these practices of rulership to do through drugs. But, but but the but the um Walking Dead, they actually believe that this is gonna be spooky zombies. They don't understand. Like no, no, we we know they. That's what that's an entertainment. They, right. It's a lack of bread. Right. Exactly. Here, exactly. Here. Exactly. We know yeah. that. They think it's just gonna be some motherfuckers. They don't know why the hell he checks up this nigga. Huh. And that's the spirit of uh, Egypt versus Egypt too, right? That like um the Walking Dead, cause that's the that's the jab versus the unjab. That's the um, people with conscience oh, versus yeah. the people without conscience. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cause the unconscious never never attack each other. Mm-hmm. They also attack the people who's um who's the light. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Or, 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 or got bit or whatever. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Who's feeling that dumb shit? Yeah. It's everybody. There ain't no damn zombie apocalypse. Man, ain't no. that's for the joke. Oh yeah, that's just for the movies. Yeah, yeah like, exactly. you know. Um, let the Lord release that shit, man. This world be over quick. Oh yeah, hell yeah. Um, uh, uh, world uh, war, war Z. Type yeah, shit, yeah, man. yeah, yeah, yeah. It should be over quick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you see in that movie, that shit was over quick. Man, come on. Within man. a week, man, that motherfucker that took over the world, my nigga. He had to get on the plane with his family and flee. Yeah, yeah. They were showing on on the globe. On the globe. That shit was red, man. Come on, man. Them motherfuckers was running quick. Man, Climbing yeah, buildings yeah. and walls, man. Yeah, that was on another level. Yeah, that Using shit was Using each wrong. other to get who they wanted to get. Mm-hmm. Police running the store. You think he come to stop the crime? Hey, man, that man came to grab some um, Infamil and some diapers for his kid back home. He said, I ain't here. Man, he ran right past everybody. Mm-hmm. Grabbed them shit for his kids. He got the fuck out of Dodge. You better do what I'm doing. Get up out of here. Mm-hmm. He says, um, Mark 3 and, um... 25. If the house be divided against itself, the house cannot stand. And if Satan rise up against himself and be divided, he cannot stand. Yeah, you watch when Satan rise up against himself. Because America got a spirit of wickedness in itself. And who's the wicked? He saw Edom. Satan. 
and Esau Edom done poisoned the minds of these people here in Babylon the Great. So you about to fight each other, especially when the food is done, when the medicine starts to disappear. Oh yeah, the medicine, a lot of people look at food the same medicine the same way they look at food. Why you think a um, motherfucker went crazy? My man put AIDS uh, medicine up, damn near a million dollars a pill. They went crazy. They had to um, send the FBI to go get this motherfucker. Mm. Cause a lot of these people depend on these pills, depend on these drugs, depend on these witchcraft <laughs> and pharma, 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 pharmaceutical um, devices. All the motherfuckers on respirators. Wait till the lights go out. Oh yeah, right. Oh yeah, motherfuckers on with the pacers, wheelchairs. Wheelchairs, or you got electric wheelchair. Not we see one dude, man, it was raining. His ass was stuck. He couldn't, he couldn't go past. Cause man, for that, if that rain hit that um, electrical wheelchair, he would have been stuck in the rain. So his Fried. ass was stuck for an hour, man, between his viaduct, man. <laughs> but praying to God, man, the motherfucking rain stopped, man. Ain't nobody yeah. help but the Lord. Oh yeah, man, nobody. <laughs> now you know, the Lord. That nigga should have got a big ass umbrella. That's what he should have got. But that's what's coming to you, either, man. Cause you depend what on Egypt, you depend on Esau. You ain't looking for the holy. You should have been praying, hey Lord, Lord, I know you can make my legs work, more, man. Lord, please hear my my legs. You, man, come on, ain't nothing impossible with what y'all by asking y'all shot, man. Shalom. Shalom, my one. Wheelchair freight. Come on, man. Where it is? <laughs>